In this video, we're not going to show you any new technique. We're just going to show you how to convert any base into any base. And we're going to start with a base 5 number, and we want to convert it into base 3. This is going to take a two-step process. The first process is to convert the number into base 10. And we're going to do that using the expansion method. We have the digits laid out here, 3, 2, 1, 4, of the desired number that we want to convert. And we have the powers above it and then what those places are worth. So we use the expansion method and we say 3 times 5 to the power of 3, 2 times 5 to the power of 2, 1 times 5 to the power of 1, and 4 times 5 to the power of 0. And when we break that out into the non-exponent form, we get 3 times 125, 2 times 25, 1 times 5, and 4 times 1. Then we add those numbers together, 375 plus 50 plus 5 plus 4. 3214 in base 10 is 434. And that is not our desired base, it's just going to be our temporary number until we can take base 10 and convert it into base 3. Now that we know what the number is in base 10, we can use the ladder method to figure out what 434 in base 3 is. So we take the desired base and we take the number in base 10 and divide the desired base into the number. It goes 144 times with a remainder of 2. We divide again, it's 48, remainder 0. We divide again, 16, remainder 0. 5, remainder 1. 1, remainder 2. And then the last time, 3 goes into 1 0 times, and we just keep the remainder. We then take all of the remainders and put them together. So 4 3 4 in base 3 is 1 2 1 0 0 2. We have made a two step conversion from base 5 to base 10 to base 3. So anytime you want to convert any base into any base, you could use this two step process. Remember, there are some bases that have special relationships where you're able to convert directly from one to the other. But if that is not the case, this is a method to go with.